cricket fans welcome to another episode of reverse swing the cricket show I'm your host Dost Ahmed and well what a day today second day of test match between uh, England and Pakistan or aaj aaj ka jo hai show is sponsored by Shan Masala the world famous Shan Masala uh, no it's not sponsored by Shan Masala but uh, mausam thoda hai aaj kal acha maine kaha bahar aaj kar lete hain shoot aur शान मसाला पीछे ग्रिल रखी हुई है तो शान मसाला के मीट एंटराइजर होने चाहिए कुर्बानी का मौका भी है और जो परफॉर्मेंस आज शान मसूद ने दी है तो उसके हिसाब से शान फूड्स को हमें स्पॉन्सर कर देना चाहिए प्लीज गेट सम स्पॉन्सर्स एनी वेज वॉट अ ब्रिलियन परफॉर्मेंस टू डे बाय द पाकिस्तानी टीम सुबह स्टार्ट थोड़े शेक ही हुआ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट दैट फॉर लिल बेट बाबर आजम सिक्सटी नाइन पे कल फर्स्ट डे पे ख़त्म किया था उन्होंने अपने और आज सुबह सिक्सटी नाइन पर ही वापस चले गए But uh, you know it was good to see um, Shan kind of play the knock which he did. कल मैंने कहा था कि it was uh, he played a little slow based on my liking, so it was good that he finally picked up the pace. And a um, little concerned uh, that Asad Shafiq uh, was not able to you know get into the runs. And Rizwan, so honestly, मुझे इतनी ज़्यादा expectation नहीं है. I know he did well, um, you know during the uh, test match, uh, the the practice matches. But uh, let's see. Well, let's see how he does. Uh, very surprised by the way Shada played. Um, it's interesting when he came out to bat. You know, the first, uh, the third ball and the sixth ball that he played. बिल्कुल लग रहा था कि T20 mindset में आया and he was ready to go 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 on with it, right? Uh, but I think if you if I can find uh, you know a similarity between the two, Shan and uh, the way um, Shada played today. It was interesting. Both are captains for their respective teams in PSL, right? Um, Shadab is for Islamabad United, and Shan captain the Multan Sultan's team, the last edition of PSL. And I think both of them did a remarkable job, right? If you look at the campaign for both of those teams, and their individual performances, which you think were quite achieved, gained the. And I spoke about that yesterday, right? If you look at Shadab's batting, they think quite have to improve. So it was good to see uh, Shadab, you know, play the knock which he did. I think it was much needed for somebody that is coming to bat at uh, number seven spot. Or uh, we expect the same from other batsmen as well. Uh, can you know they get to score the runs which uh, we sh- uh, they should be scoring. Uh, but you know, kudos to Shan the way he played. You know, I think it's his uh, three consecutive centuries on one in Mariha, Sri Lanka khilaf, Bangladesh khilaf, or England mein. Uh, and it's his highest score as well. Uh, Both the dominant knock laga mujhe end me uh, when you know the wicket started to fall. Thoda sa ek lazy elegance mein nazar aata hai. Thodi sha bahat aati hai. Usme aaj laga maine highlights bagara bhi dekhi baat mein Alistair Cook ki kyunki height bhi thodi si uski lambi hai aur thoda skinny sa hai. So it looked good. Lo thoda sa lazy elegance thoda ek grace nazar aata hai. If he expresses himself, so he can be a, you know much better batsman. Magar thoda dar dar ke bhi khelta hai wo. Uh, so that was good. You know, Pakistan. I think got a very formidable uh, total. Um, second innings, which we talk about, I mean, the uh, England's first innings. So, what a start from Pakistan! Dream start, right? I mean, we talked about this yesterday. You know, it's going to be a competition between the young uh, pacers of Pakistan with the inexperienced lineup of England, and it showed today, right? Uh, good reviews by Azhar Ali. You know, showing confidence in his bowlers and the uh, fielders that are kind of placed close to the field. Um, let's talk about the delivery that uh, uh, Ben Stokes got uh, up front. Right? What? Uh, um, I have seen delivery at least 15 times. Now, in the replay, whatever, because I wanted to get a perspective. Because what was it? Was it such a beautiful delivery? Or what was it? Because when you look at the live action, you feel that it was such a delivery that was popular. Ramos gave the impression that it came out like this and it came out like this and it came out like this. But uh, I watched that highlight at least 15 times today. 
because I wanted to see what happened. Because Ben Stokes is a very accomplished batsman. So getting him on out on zero is a big deal. And he, we know he's injured. He didn't really bowl. So he's, got a, he's carrying a niggle into this match. So it's very interesting. If you look at the first match, they covered his uh, positioning, right? Where he's standing, his stance is outside. So he's standing way outside the crease. Uh, and then when ball Abbas has released ki hai, so you can notice that he steps a little forward from his crease to play the shot um, right but there are two things in it one is that a very slide ball is under and it is very slow and it is out of the way so it is a very faint swing but the beauty uh, is, for me it was not about the swing it was more about the length of the delivery right so I think one of the commenters I don't know Nasir Thay Nasir Santia Kuyorste, he called it the uh, bail trimmer was the term that they used uh, for that delivery, right? Because the length was so critical, so when the ball came out, it, it just kissed the top of off, right? And, you know, hitting the top of off is what they uh, preach uh, in bowling academies. I mean, from a test match standpoint, you know, even T20, we talk about T20, we talk about the other one, good delivery, it's lower one, hai, but then top of off is one of the most difficult lengths to bowl to. But... For a pass to kind of judge where Ben was uh, standing in his stance, and then from that standpoint, you know, wo aage bhi bada. Uske hisab se wo same length ko control karna. I think for me, that delivery, um, the 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 length of the delivery was more, uh, you know, remarkable and amazing for me compared to the actual swing of that delivery. Uh, Let's talk about uh, uske baad, we talked about Ali Pope yesterday. We thought that he would be out of the but no, I think he's playing a very good inning. He scored for pretty much half of uh, England's run right now. And let's see, it will be critical to get him out tomorrow. Um, Josh Butler, he looks like he's getting into you know the, the hang of things. Uh, what else? I think uh, I tried to attend to you know, notice little things while the match is going on. I think one of the most cricketers in the background was sitting Yunus Khan was looking He was very happy today and I was happy for him as well because you know, he spent a lot of time with Sean but just kind of looking at him with his notebook, just taking notes. On his left and the right hand side, he was sitting on the right hand side. And then Agi Jyotav Mushtaq better with the Mushtaq Ahmad. So it was very, you know, good to see that we are um, giving respect and an opportunity to our, um, you know, older cricketers, right? And, uh, you know, hopefully we get the results. Uh, it's very important. They can mazak wager the kafi udate hain, mare shows wagera mein aur istara. But it's very important to give them the respect, um, and especially when they're putting the effort. So I really hope, uh, you know, excited. Um, that we have been able to have uh, Pakistani uh, players, ex-players as coaches, um, you know, and so they can bring the experience, they can help the players uh, get groomed as well, right? And I know there's been, you know, back and forth about whether we should get foreign coaches or not. There's pros and cons to both. But I think it's good to, to see the players, uh, like energy in the field, mein, you know, like young core hai team, ka, fast bowlers are young, you know, the batting lineup is young as well. Uh, relatively so it's good to see uh, and um, it, the team has the right mix of experience I think right now relatively very young hai. So, but that will come over time right so you know exciting day today as far as um, uh, you know the Pakistan team's form is concerned with the bat and then also with the ball with the ball um, so let's see what day three brings tomorrow or my time is over I go to the Tikki Wicket and uh, Sean if you're watching the show please Sean Masood ke liye. Unki khatar jo hai sponsor karte hain please thank you see you guys tomorrow take care bye